Hi, I'm Jonah from Teachable, and if you're watching this, you're probably wondering if you can actually build a sellable online course in three days, and the answer is absolutely yes. Now, to some of you, that may sound too good to be true, and that's why I want to take this video to show you some of the tools we have at Teachable that make this completely possible, and especially if you're an existing YouTuber or content creator who already has a library of content. So honestly, what I'm going to show you is the cleverest and fastest way I've seen for taking your existing content, identifying what is valuable, and structuring it into a powerful online course that you can sell directly to your customers, creating a brand new income stream for your business that you own. And stick around till the end of the video because one of the best parts of this system is it also can skyrocket your channel growth. Let's dive in and I'm going to show you how this works. So the first step to this process is understanding what your course is gonna be about and what a curriculum for that course might look like. In the pre-AI days, this was the hardest part of creating an online course. But now Teachable has a wealth of powerful tools at your disposal that quickly help you brainstorm and outline what an online course could look like for you. So the first thing we need to do to access these tools is to sign up for a free Teachable account. It's absolutely free to sign up, so there's no risk here, just go do it. It, click the link below down in the pinned comments or in the description or just go to teachable.com and click sign up for free. Once you've created an account and you're logged in, go to courses and click new course and give your course a name. You don't have to fret about this. You can always change any part of your course down the road and a course is something that will evolve and grow as your business and your audience and students grow. And don't underestimate the basics. So if you're a cook, you could start with just basic kitchen etiquette or knife skills. If your content is about photography, it could be as simple as what camera to buy or what information you need to know to buy a good camera. My one bit of advice here is try and choose something that you've already made content about and not some new venture that you want to expand on in the near future. I obviously like playing guitar, so for this example, I'm going to do an introduction course for the guitar. Next, you're going to click the Help Me Get Started with AI, and this is where the magic happens. So the more thorough you can be with your description, the better the results. If you can let it know what you want your students to get out of the course and be clear about the different sections and lessons, that helps. But once again, don't overthink it. Done is better than perfect. So I wrote, I want to create a beginning guitar course that covers the very basics of guitar. It should cover what kind of guitars there are, the differences between acoustic and electric guitars, and some basic chords and strumming techniques to get someone started and excited about learning music. Also, make sure to end with a section that's dedicated to popular songs that you can learn with just four chords. Please. Then click Generate Course and give it a minute to do its magic. And just like that, you have a comprehensive outline for what a powerful course for a beginning guitarist might look like. And on top of the outline in each lesson, there's a summary of what that lesson could look like. Now, here's the beauty of this system. Now, all you have to do is identify which piece of content you already have that can satisfy a lesson in this course. You don't have to hit every lesson. Maybe a video you already have serves a few different lessons or a whole section, but all you are doing is matching your existing content with the outline of the course. And uploading that content is super simple. Just click on any individual lesson, click add content, choose video, and you can upload your existing content into a lesson just like that. Now, you're probably asking yourself the question that a lot of creators have asked me when I tell them to start building a course this way, which is why would anyone buy a course that's just populated with content that they can access for free on my YouTube channel? Well, that's the beauty of an online course is a lot of the value isn't in each individual piece of content, it's in the step-by-step -step structure walking someone through who they are, who they want to be, and each step along the way to get there. This is something you likely haven't done on your channel or with your existing content. Putting all of that valuable information into context in an A to B format. You may already be doing something like this with your channel by the recommended videos or playlists, 
but an online course is a central place where you can sell this information in a clear transformation and engage with comments or other elements. So although this is all you need to do to get an online course built and sellable and ready to deliver to your audience, Teachable offers a variety of powerful tools and additional products that can help level up a course and create a more impactful experience for your students. Everything from audio and additional resources you can pull from your lead magnets, as well as quizzes to help your students retain the information. And you can even add a community now to your course so that you can have focused discussions with your students and help them learn better and connect with each other and teach each other as well. And now I'm going to reveal the small tool that allows you to make this process even faster and save you tons of time without having to upload anything. In any lesson, when you click add video, if you upgrade to any paid Teachable account, you get access to the embed feature. So now all you have to do is click the video add button and then embed, pull the video from your YouTube channel that you want to add to your course, copy the link, paste it into the embed, and you've just saved an immense amount of time with no editing or uploading and better than ever when someone watches the video in your course, it is driving plays and traffic back to your YouTube channel, helping your business and your channel at the same time. So at this point, all that's left is a little bit of arranging, editing any text to make sure it's true to your voice. You can preview any lesson or your entire course at any time to see what it'll look like for a student. And then all you have to do is publish your course, add a pricing plan, and you have now created a functional new income stream for your business that you can test with your audience right away and that you own and are not dependent on ads or sponsorships to maintain. So hopefully at this point you see why I'm such a big proponent of this system. It helps you avoid any writer's block or wasted energy trying to generate what a course would look like and what a powerful transformation can be. It saves you an immense amount of time downloading, editing, and re-uploading your content while also harnessing the power of your existing content that you already know resonates with your audience. And more than anything, it allows you to create a brand new valuable income stream for your business that also has a powerful impact for your audience. And remember, you can always and will improve your online course over time. But the hardest part is getting started and getting a product out there so you can start getting real live feedback from your students and your audience. And this by far is the fastest and easiest way to do that. And the answer to the question, can you actually build and publish and start selling an online course in three days? And if you're still having doubts, go check out this video from Robert Benjamin, where he expands on how he quickly started building online courses and creating a new income stream for his business using this exact method. Thank you as always for spending your time with us. I hope this video was valuable. And if it was, please like the video and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more content like this. And let us know in the comments if you had any aha moments or still have any questions exactly about how you can use this for your own business.